fourth teenager is under arrest this morning, charged in the beating death of a 16-year-old. Police caught a major break thanks to cell phone video taken by a witness and given to Fox station WFLD. Barbara Pinto is in Chicago. She's following the developments for us this morning. Good morning, Barbara. What do we know? Good morning, Chris. Police are crediting that grainy cell phone video with what they're calling the first round of arrests in this case. Four teenagers, the youngest only 16, all charged in the very adult crime of murder. Honor student Darian Albert walked home from school and into this. A vicious street fight between rival groups. Albert in the black shirt and tan pants is clubbed in the head with a wooden plank. When he tries to get up, others punch and then stomp him until the 16-year-old stops moving. He died hours later. By all accounts, Albert was a homebody who loved computers, his church, and Bible study. We lost a really dear friend and my grandson. Albert is the third Chicago student murdered in the three weeks since school started here, the latest in what seems like Chicago's endless cycle of children killing children. Enough is past enough. We have to change some things and start it today. Clergy, classmates, and Albert's family held a vigil at the scene of the beating. Police have stepped up patrols in the neighborhood, but for Darian Albert, this is all too little, too late. I love my grandson, I miss him dearly. Just lose him like this, not even knowing, just so, woo, just so senseless. Now, police are expecting more arrests in this case with Chicago in the world spotlight with its Olympic bid. This is not the kind of attention this city wants.